Hey everyone, Josie here at Kern Laser Systems. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to be creating a custom foam toolkit that will help you organize and store your tools easily and efficiently. There are a couple steps needed to create this custom foam toolkit. First, we will start with our foam and what tools we want to organize. Once you know how you want to arrange your tools on the foam, you will then transfer them to a surface, lining them up as you did on the foam before. There are many different ways you can do this. We are using a 24 by 48 light panel. Our tools are lined up how we want them. Now we take a picture and import it into CorelDRAW. Our panel is a 24 by 48 rectangle. It is important to have a border around your tools and to know the size so we can make sure the tools in the file are scaled correctly. Let's create the file. Our image is imported into CorelDRAW. First, we will make a box that is 24 by 48. We will take that box and line it up with the light panel in the picture. We will try to get as close as we can. Now we know the tools in our file will be the correct size. To make things easier, we will crop out the sides of the picture to eliminate the background. Now that our picture is the right size and is focused on the shape of the tools, we will convert our picture into a bitmap and make it black and white. This will give us a great contrast. Now we will trace the bitmap. The easiest way is to use the Quick Trace Bitmap tool. The image is now very dark, but when you click and drag, you can see the outline of our tools. So now we will click on the color white and right click on black to give us a hairline trace around the tools. Now ungroup everything and clean up the lines by deleting excess nodes and creating smooth lines. This is our finished file. Now we will select our part and send it over to KCAM using the Selection Export tool. We will be cutting this half inch foam on our 150 watt laser. In KCAM, we will be going 1.5 inches per second at 50% power. And our PSI will be set to 50. We have set our user offset and focused the cutting head to the foam. We are ready to cut the toolkit. Thanks for watching today's video on how to create a custom foam toolkit. This will help you take your toolbox organization to the next level. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and make sure to like and subscribe to stay up to date with all things Kern Lasers. We'll see you in the next video.